Hey guys, and welcome back to The Evil Within. When we last left off, we were trying to find out what happened to O'Neill. And uh, to do that, we have to follow Hoffman's footsteps. So, let's continue. We're in the Marrow, of course, the Restricted Labs. Excellent. Oh, yes, we have some friends here, too. Although they're not that friendly, being dead. Having said that... If they're dead, they're at least friendlier than the things trying to eat our face. So, I suppose it swings and roundabouts. Oh yeah, I forgot about this little, this little tweaker that we had here. Um, now, what way were we going? I think we came from the elevator, didn't we? So we need to go this way. Oh, hello. This looks very Resident Evil, the original film. On the way to the Red Queen or whatever she was. Called? Hello. Well, this is something a little bit different. I'm also on holiday now. What's this about? I don't know. But we're about to find out, Sebastian. Yeah, so I'm now on holiday, so I'm hoping that I can complete this game fairly quick. Um, it's nice to have all this time just to spend gaming. Uh, think little things like that you really miss. Hmm. No statues about, I'd wager. Ooh. And we have bodies. Bodies in bags. Best place to put a body, I suppose. Stop some stinking up the joint. Ah, and we're still saving for our synapsis um, mod. Ooh, this tank's empty. Is that for us? You shouldn't have. But uh, sadly, we cannot take a rest in a tank just yet. For no, for our job is not yet done. Let's go. What's the betting these things are going to jump out? Or at least one of them is. I guess we'll have to find out. It's too quiet in here. Luckily, we've got a trusty gun with us. So, oh, we can't go through there. Okay, that's a little bit on the deceiving side. I was hoping that we could. Very, very quiet in here. Oh. <clears throat> that could be problematic. Can't pass through without one of those chips. No. One around here somewhere. Yeah, you would have thought so, my friend. You would have thought so. Let's have a little look, shall we? See what we can find. Well, we take the fuse. So you can ruin some monsters' day later on. Oh. Oh well, I say. Here's a corpse. Hey, bub, do you have one of these uh, chips that we need? Hmm. Not quite sure what they've done with this chap. There's a file there, which is nice. Oh, biohazardous waste. Infectious waste. No. Ah! Ah ha 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 ha. Hello, my friend. Welcome to the party. Let's have a little look at you. Let's see if we can give you some stabbing action. Let's try and stay behind this chap. Hey, buddy. You just stay right there, my friend. Let me stab you to death. There we go. Feel better for that, my friend? Of course you do. Got some nice gel. 300, not bad. Don't we need like 7,500 gel? Um, for our upgrade. That is a lot, man. We're going to spend like the rest of the game. Ooh, a bottle. We're literally going to spend the rest of the game, I reckon, just grinding for that upgrade. But I reckon that upgrade is going to be literally amazing. It's a sad thing that happened to you, buddy. Uh, stem system 
uh, integration irregularities, we have begun to observe a new unexpected side effect of STEM integration. In certain Union citizens, the symptoms begin simply enough, small mental breaks triggered by vestigial memory overlaps. Affected citizens begin to experience their old memories, which leaves them in a state of confusion. Rewriting their memories again is only a stopgap measure. The new Union designations serve only to confuse them further. Soon these small breaks develop into complete uh, disassociation and eventually total uh, physical metamorphosis. Oh, this phenomenon is currently affecting only naught well, yeah, 0.005% of the populace, but it's troubling nevertheless. Much was learned after this beacon incident, but STEM is still experimental technology. We are isolating our studies while we continue to expand Union. It is imperative that we stop this before it escalates. Yes, well. Well, good luck with that, guys, because it does appear to be a little bit of an issue. Not that I'm poo-pooing all of your hard work, of course. It is an impressive fuck up, to say the least. What's over here? <clears throat> we can't play with that one yet. More bottles. We don't really want bottles, though. We want keys, we want ammo, and we want parts. Oh, there's some gel there. That's rather lovely. Yoink. Oh, hello. Oh, that's one of those freeze me jigs, yeah. Well, we shall take it. Oh. Hello. Who's joined the party now? It's okay. You'll soon be at ease. I promise. Oh, there you are. Sorry, love. But that's enough of that disgusting feeding. Damn cannibal scum. There we go. Trust me, you're going to be in a better place. Let's have a look at these things. Oof. They're definitely gooey. Ugh. I do like the creature design, I'm not going to lie. I think it's really good. Now, was that something else breaking free? <gasps> almost. I almost broke into song. Bit of queen. Hmm. Well, this area looks pretty much clear. Oh, god damn it. An empty drawer, honestly. Ain't nobody got time for an empty drawer. We want drawers full of loot. Or even big weapons. Big weapons are nice. Oh, oh. Uh oh. Go on, love, this way. We're going to get our stab on. Honestly. Turn around and I'll make you feel better. It's a guaranteed cure. Come get my patented guarantee cure. There we go. Beautiful. See, the, notice how that um, actual move kicked in then. Whereas it rarely kicks in. Oh, I think this place crawls now. This place crawls. Where are you to, my friend? Come on, make yourself heard. I can't cure you if I don't know where you are. Oh, are you eating that corpse over here? It sounds like... Oh, no, you're over here. Or are you above us? You might be above us, mayhap. If you're above us, that's okay. Yep. 
definitely above us, I think. Or is he? Yeah, he's definitely above us. Okay, that's good. That's good. Let's go and investigate. We'll investigate up there in a minute. Let's have a look through here. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, lots of stuff. Gunpowder. Always nice. Looks like we have more company. Now, was that upstairs? Or was it downstairs? Yes, parts. Thank you. Definitely want to upgrade our shotgun. We want our little shotgun to be the little shotgun that could. That sounds like it's upstairs. Alright, we can deal with that. Now, can we? Can we climb up and over? No. That's a shame. What is in the lab? Ooh. 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 How much health do we have? We've got loads of health. So we don't need that. Now, I definitely don't find these enemies in the slightest scary. But they are fun to fight, and they are good. Ooh. Nice. We have a target-rich environment here, ladies and gentlemen. Irregularity studies. Uh, the phenomenon has become more prevel uh, yeah, prevalent. Ugh. I tell you what, dyslexia sucks. Um, especially when you can read it in your head, but you can't get the word out. Very annoying. Uh, <clears throat> we have... Uh, Dedicated the entire laboratory wing of the marrow studying it. Citizen transformations have become quick, violent, and even more obscene. They are mutating into forms that can't be considered humanoid. They have lost any semblance of humanity altogether. We have dubbed these afflictions, uh, afflicted citizens, the lost. We have determined that the last phase before they metamorphosis involves the belief that they are being pursued by some invisible but inescapable force. Once they have succumbed to this force, their transformation begins. Stem is an artificial construct. There are no viruses, bacteria, or contagion here. The lost phenomenon is therefore a mental process. We are still in the dark as to how it spreads and to whom it will spread to next. Perhaps the trigger was present in the subjects before they ever entered STEM. Further research is needed. Uh-oh. Well, that doesn't sound good. So it's a mental condition. That's interesting. Definitely a fan of that. You'd also expect there to be a key here, wouldn't you? Somewhere, hidden away. But it doesn't seem to be much. Right, let's head on upstairs. Okay, upstairs we go. Might be worth getting our silence gun out, but I'm not sure. I don't really want to use ammo if I don't have to. Because our bullets are precious, yo. Alright, pal. You're having a bad time. Well, you did have a bad time. Your bad time's now over. Indefinitely. Hmm. Where is this disgruntled gentleman? Oh, there you are. Let's come at you from the other way. If we can, yeah, we should be able to. We should be able to. We get the drop on this fool, stab him up a little bit. You know, the good stuff. And then we can explore in peace. There's lab two. The last thing we want now is more spawning. Hey, buddy. Ah, fucking hell. What did I say? Last thing we need now is more spawning. 
we get more spawning? What we could do, perhaps, damn it, come on, right, let's upset them, oh god, here we go, that was bad, well, come at me bro, throw down if you think you have a pair. Come on, buddy. Let's do this thing, then. Me and you, my friend. Me and you. Me, you, and my gun, anyway. Accuracy for the win. Well, it was going to happen eventually, I suppose. Well, to the victors, the spoils. We are over half... Well, n yeah, we are over halfway, I believe, to getting that upgrade. Some more gel, lovely. Just what the doctor ordered. Am I right? Of course I'm right. It's not often I'm right, so when I am right, I like to revel in the fact. <clears throat> right, so what was in here then? And uh, that's lab three. We check lab two first, because, you know. Seems to be the the right process. Come on, Sebastian. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Anybody home? I guess someone's home. Forty percent of Union's populace has succumbed already. Forty percent. Twenty percent. They're actively hunting down and killing whoever is left. It's a nightmare. At this rate, there will be no one left. Too weak. We've lost contact with Mobius. We're trapped in here. With the lost. It's too late to stop now. The entire Union experiment is doomed. We're now that's a negative, Nancy. I'm sorry. Hmm. So these uh, lost guys are not infinite. It's not like they're spawning out of nowhere. Ooh. What have you got for me, bruh? Pouch up. Ooh. Nice. Don't mind if I do. That's all the medical pouches. We can have six syringes now. I think in uh, the first game, couldn't you upgrade it to you had like... Um, it was something ridiculous, like ten. Or it might have been nine. It was very nice either way. Very nice indeed. Well, there doesn't appear to be too much here. You know, for a lab, this place isn't exactly clean, is it? Right, now where was that syringe? It was like down here somewhere. Because I like my syringes, yo. Especially the dual wieldy type. Come on. If I was a syringe... Full of medical goodness. Where would I be? Oh, we can take the bottles. Alright, well. If we've got space for bottles, we're going to have them, yo. Because we need a nice bottle collection. Oh, was it out there? I don't think it was. Yeah, it makes sense that we... We find syringes in a laboratory. Makes perfect sense. In fact, we should be finding more. They should be everywhere. Full of all kinds of delicious chemicals. At least... Is that is it just me that thinks that? I mean, I think we should. Where the hell? Where was that syringe? I get loads of comments telling me about how like stupid and derpy I am. That I can't even simple uh, remember simple things. But that's okay. Let's 
Seriously, where was that? Yeah. Well, it doesn't matter too much, I suppose. <clears throat> you know, we can always make syringes. We have, like, millions and millions and millions of um, herbs. Okay, millions might be an over-exaggeration. Maybe. Ah, was it in there? Could have been. I don't think it was, though. Well, we have a bottle on the floor here. So, we'll have E. God damn it. Seriously? Do I honestly not remember where that thing was? I mean, you know, obviously I don't remember. Oh, hello. Where that thing was. Otherwise, I would have it. Ooh, almost missed those bad boys. That would have been... Ah, there we go. That would have been unacceptable. <clears throat> that is a lot of health. Oh, hello. Hey, my friend. Well, you know, it didn't have to be this way. You could have stayed asleep. And we could have all lived happily ever after. Apart from you, of course. You were destined to die from the moment you woke up. Or should I say the moment you went into STEM, really. Very few people get out of STEM. You know. Uh, tis the way it is, though, I suppose. You know. I don't make the rules. I wish I did. But I don't. Now, this place was picked... Oh, I say this place was picked clean. I almost missed those as well. My god, I am not on my A-game today. Am I ever on my A-game? I don't know. Probably not. Probably not. It's best not to think about it too much. It's the sort of stuff that would drive a man crazy. Ah, bullets. Well, this looks bloody om ominous, doesn't it? Almost feel like we should find Wesker here somewhere. Jill, is that you? Ooh. Got some tools. Right, okay. Lots of fresh bodies here. Ready to rise from their grave. 50 parts. This is nice. We seem to be um, posted no trespassing. Keep out. Okay. We seem to be finding uh, parts in higher quantities now, which is good. We got some gentlemen lying there on the floor. Lovely. And it looks like a file. Computer file. Operative case. Our worst fears have been realized. The lost phenomenon has spread to Mo Mobius operatives. We have theorized that the transformations were a result of memory overwrite, but no operatives have been overwritten. We were also able to quarantine and terminate an effective Mobius oper operative before he could transform. Perhaps his exposure to so many lost corpses in the pit made him susceptible to whatever is causing this. Perhaps it's merely a coincidence. We are harvesting his Unity Cerebral chip in the hopes that it will provide new data. Uh, of course. Removal of intact Cerebral chips are possible with the extraction device. It's a relatively simple and automated process. Merely place the subject on the gurney and enter the extraction device's activation code, 0228. If they haven't, what do we have here? Yeah. Oh, that looks delicious. How do we fiddle with this? Uh, ooh. 0602. Where do we fiddle with the stuff? I like to fiddle with the stuff. Do we fiddle with the stuff at the computer? No. Oh, hello. Is it? Oh, one, two, eight. Okay, let's see what happens. Sorry about this, buddy. This is a remax, you're dead, but you know. Wow, that chip that chip is deep in your brain. So 
we could add by chip now. And we also have to try 0602. Let's do it. Oh, can we not now? Hang on. This electronic chip was implanted in the brain of a Mobius operative. Oh, thank God he's already dead. I gotta get out of this lab. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Ooh. Unless that's for another one that we come across. Might be worth making a mental note of that. 0206. Really? Unless we had to do that before. Very tempted to reload that checkpoint. Um, where would that be? Oh, man. Oh, 320. Uh, if we load that, where does it put us? I bet it puts us as we extract the chip, or just after. Yeah. Arse. I bet we had to do that before, which is really annoying. Hey guys, anybody alive? Present yourselves. No need to hide. Oh, sounds like we've got a lot of fun downstairs. Have any fun upstairs? Sure does sound like there could be fun upstairs. Oh. Oh, there we go. We go round behind him. Get the drop on that son of a bitch. Stab him in the back of the head. Because why not? <clears throat> I might look that uh, 0206 up. Or 0602 up. Because uh, if that's a key that we've potentially missed, that's really cheap that you can't redo that. If I say so myself. That's just a bottle, I believe. We have no need for bottles. We have loads of bottles. Come on, Sab. Let's get our sneak on. Ooh. Hello. Right. Now, has that woke that gentleman up? Yes, it has. God damn it. Well, well, I guess we're not getting our sneak murder on now, are we? Or are we? Alright, you lot. Settle down. Settle down. What's the matter with you, honestly? Feeding time at the bloody zoo, isn't it? I have a horrible feeling we're going to get spotted here. Come on, buddy. Go back to your delicious corpse. Fresh human meat. There you, there you go. Good lad. Good lad. That's why we don't pay you the big bucks. Come on, buddy. Come on. There we go. Take it like a man, or a monster, either or. Yink. Yink. Getting loads of gunpowder, which is nice. That is slightly unfortunate. Right, we should. We should. Have enough now to get out of it. Oh, is it just one of you guys? We can stab this dude in the brain. Damn it, please don't drain all. Oh, God. Okay, let's head back upstairs. Sab, you stupid bugger. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming at a rate of knots. 
Let's get tactical. Well, he's down there. Got the loss down there. We don't have any rounds for this either. Which is a little bit sucky. Can we get an angle down there? Of course we can't. That would be too convenient. Go, oh, damn it. Let's switch up. Uh, let's switch up to our silence hangar. See if we can't pop a few brains. You gonna stay there for me, buddy? You gonna stop tweaking your head around? Oh, there's some kind of wall there. Of course there is. Don't want anything to be too convenient now. My god, chaps. This place certainly is crawling now. If it wasn't crawling before, it's crawling now. We are never going to make it to him before he turns around. But we can try. Oh, sir, you stupid bastard. You, you, oh, you're a lady. You silly woman. Oh, well. Oh. Oh, there's a couple of them. Do we have any explosives? We do. Be rude not to use them, wouldn't it? I think that was fairly efficient use. That is, of course, if it actually did the trick. Right, they, in theory, should now be crawling over there. Well, that is in theory. Theory and practice... Where are you going, Sebastian? Theory and practice are two very different things. What? How did you know I was here? You know what, buddy? Oh, God. Uh, this is going to get worse before it gets better. There we go. You know what, buddy? Fuck you. Fuck you. In your loud, obnoxious... God damn it. Have another bottle then. <clears throat> As I was saying, fuck you. In your loud, obnoxious face. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, this isn't exactly brilliant, is it? Not brilliant, but not bad. Oh, dear. When it rains, ladies and gentlemen, it pours, apparently. Good, good lads, good lads. That's what we like to see. Not a handful of brains in the lot of you. Alright, stab and then run. Stab and then run. Sebastian, you're not really listening to me. When I say stab and run, that's kind of what I mean. You know what? I think this is a, a job for the old Mossberg. Fuck you, buddy. Ooh, nice try. Oh, dear. That was a poor try by me. Oh, dear. Hello. Get off me. Have a bottle. Then have a shotgun. All right, well, you know, messy and sloppy. But when things are sloppy and wet, they're generally more enjoyable. Right, okay, cool. Lovely green gel. <sighs> okay. Survived. Now, remember, it doesn't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Winning is most certainly winning. And you're a winner, Sebastian. Cerebral 
Temperature detected. Entry authorized. Excellent. About time. Hope I can still catch up with Hoffman and O'Neill. Bloody right. Okay, guys, I'm going to end this video here because we have gone on for quite some time now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to quickly look up that thing to see if we could get something nice there. Uh, if we can't, we'll continue off as here as, as usual. If we can get something delicious there, uh, I'll explain what it was in the next video. So, thank you very much for watching as always, guys. And as always, till next time.